Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. Woo! Attend F1 esports event. Who doesn't want to? Very understandable. Oh, we can do R&D. Point generation upgrade on the arrow. Which would move for aerodynamic spec to three. Cooking. Now we're broke though. But I think we have just enough to do a front down for the upgrades. Should come before Baku. Oh, look at all of them. All of them upgrades. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay, we've had the new parts come through the fabrication process. We'll have them with us for the next Grand Prix. Later that night. I was cooking at the gym. Look at what, what car we have cooked here, by the way. We have created a f***ing rocket ship. I, I reckon on the R&D chart, the gap from Aston to Ferrari is less than the gap from Ferrari to us. How's Jim? Train chest. And triceps, of course. I need to create a bit of a... I need to get a little bit of hat for YouTube, you know? So that when F1 23 beta comes out, I haven't done anything with it. That I can grind that. I'm also not uh, doing any other major esports competitions this year, like I did last year. So I can focus 100% on F1 23. Uh, maybe I'll do F uh, Formula E, that's the only one I'm thinking of doing. Because I've done that every year. It's been there, so. But uh, no, probably no VTNR for me. Um, no Formula Pro, obviously. America got a world team now for the series, yeah. That's the main reason they got them, because I just lost too much focus on F1 if I was doing all these other series as well. And like VTNR, I've won it. So I don't really see why I would do it again when you've done it, won it once, you know? Just kind of, it was the kind of championship I just want to win once. And I did. Simple as that. I love watching Yarno look at the durability and then decide to do none of the upgrades. Yeah, mate. Don't need it. Schumacher <laughs> P1 by 9 tenths. <laughs> Let him cook. Bill Shibai? No, not tonight. I had alcohol last night already. I can't drink too much, yeah. It's stay healthy. I'm a high performance athlete. <laughs> Welcome along then to what promises to be another fascinating Spanish Grand Prix. Vamos! After the points finished last race, let's aim to keep that momentum going. Alright, we're definitely starting on the hearts. Why are we not starting last, by the way? Again, I've got the same thing. Where three other people don't qualify. Anyway, on to the Barcelona Grand Prix. Or whatever the name is. Hold up, I don't have force feedback. I don't have force feedback. What is this? Back on it. Hey, yo! Calm down, mister. Oh, so I'm looking off. Oh, strong salt. Let me cook. Oh, bottle from Sots as well. A lot of them on the Sots compound.
No way you're gonna send it in turn 9. Five down, mister. So many on soft tires, yeah. But loosey goosey. That's fast lap. The P16. What is that? Let's just like try to peek his nose in there. Schumacher is not even on soft. He's on mediums. Alright, speed 15. Be 14 minutes. Well, if
need to get past. Carlos, Yarno is faster than you. Ay, caramba. Okay, it's flying, yeah, I know. Meet him to the end, yeah. It's possible, I think so. I hope so. <laughs> Beauty! Well, a lot of them are staying out. All the hard runners are staying out. Can I get to stop him? Leclerc out! Oh, I'm not getting anyone on. Ricciardo as well! No, they're crashing! They've all crashed in the safety car! Bro, what? Wait, did Perez crash as well? This is Perez, right? Yeah, this is Perez. <laughs> Saranaya Sakar! I might have, to, might have to make it out of pistol, but I'm not sure. 19 laps on a set of mediums. Oh well, thank you. I have no idea if we can make it to the end. 16% right now. To the next levels. Yeah, but we can make it to the end, chat. Fires will be close to blowing up, though. Is a 
back on my arm. I'm doing some tire saving now and then should be a bit more safe. Alright, it's going too slow now. We need to get past. Oh, is that unboxing? Remember what happened to Leclerc in Spain with the same engine? Shut up. He actually DNF'd as well. Fist for softs. This is why I'm PSL at 3, Jonas. Tire wear 54%. Pass on lap 33 DNF. Ain't happening, Chief. This car is incredibly reliable. Peanut butter Charlie time. Well, that might not have been the finest race in history, but there's no question it was a critical win. It was a critical win. Oh, look at my car. Natalie Broken. Pinkham, how do you think they were able to set themselves apart today? I think we'll chalk this one up as a death touch on the brake pedal. That's allowed them to challenge down the inside in the braking zones and ultimately. If you do that often enough, you'll end up winning the race. It was great to watch as well, wasn't it? Forget strategy, forget tyre management. Who doesn't love a good old-fashioned scrap? Yeah, mate. Grazie, another one two for the Pop Me Academy chat. So then, it's time to see how this result affects the drivers' championship. This result then narrows the gap between our championship leader and the rest of the standings. So then, Natalie Pink, okay. who would you rank as your driver of the day? I have to give it to Black Mamba. They did a great job at getting the very most out of the tyres without losing pace.